Okay, so I'd love to start with um, how you really began this process when you first started this project, where you got your inspiration from. Well, from the script in the beginning, just reading like, you know, what Rupert wanted to, to do with the movie and the screenplay and having Snow White be somebody that's a survivor that's been through a lot that you, you find her at the beginning of the story and she's already a young woman but, you know, manages to escape and sort of start her own life and fight for her life and the things that she believes in. So when we're talking about the dress Kristen Stewart wears for most of it. How did you decide on color and form? She's very active in this movie. Well, we started the, the movie when she's in prison. And she wears the basically the same costume. It's just longer over the leggings and the flat boots. So she fits in that world like somebody's handed her that as she's grown up in the prison and that she's into the same things as the other prisoners. And once she gets escapes and meets up with the huntsman, he actually cuts off her dress and makes it so she can run and move and do all the things that, that she has to do for the bulk of the movie in the costume. Charlize's first fitting was just like, you know, she was like, oh yeah. <laughs> she was so into it. And I think the cape was probably her, her first thing with this long black dress that's in a poster. Uh, that was kind of her first look and it sort of got her thinking like where she was going with it and she was very enthusiastic about the silhouette and everything and so I was able to just kind of spin out from there once we did the first kind of go around with her. How did you decide on kind of the progression of the way her character dresses? Well the script sort of dictated it and her you know the development of her character she comes from you know kind of a hopeful place to be a queen again and thinking she's gonna like make it work and then she's right. just genetically flawed to to fail and starts kind of deteriorating and falling apart so her costumes kind of crumble along with her they go from light to darker mm -hmm. to very dark at the end so it's sort of that journey today i'm kind of favoring the, the dress behind me the wedding dress but it changes all the time you know with, like depending on how long I've looked at them in one day or what's right. going on. The collar was inspired by kind of a skeletal cage idea with, um, it's made out of uh, parchment paper that's been kind of manipulated into that shape and kind of twisted and formed. The Huntsman outfit, how did this design come about? The idea of that was about purpose. Mm -hmm. It was about what it had to do, how it had to serve him in the woods where he lived alone. and had been taking care of himself. You know, all leathers and things that he could have found and crafted or traded with, with townspeople as far as the shirt goes, but it's all very rough and, you know, of the people. Well, this is the Black Army. Uh, it's Ravenna's army in the beginning mm -hmm. of the story. The idea of it is that it's kind of a, a ghost army that's defeated by the Silver Army um, and shatters into fragments. So we sort of wanted it to have a kind of medieval feeling but with a little bit of a thing that would work like if it went into crystal formation when it's broken up so we kind mm -hmm. of backed into it that way and created it you know in that way. Kristen Stewart's character also wears armor in the film. Was it difficult designing that for a woman? The idea with her armor it has elements of all different armors in it so it okay. looks like that that you know it's element of the it's it's armor of the people and um, the way her armor was sculpted on a form that you know, was her size, so you just, you know, design it in a way that the scale and everything works on a woman. I've made over a thousand costumes for this film, including two armies. It's been an incredible undertaking and in collaborating with these three main actors. This has been an amazing experience for me.